The Tourism Board remains strongly opposed to offshore drilling. Today's tourism meets or exceeds the low and mid-level projections for oil and gas 21 years from now. We are the future of the Outer Banks, not just my generation, but also the ones that follow. The proposal for offshore drilling threatens the future of this island we call home, whose time is already limited. An oil spill on the island, on the Outer Banks, anywhere in North Carolina, would grossly compound our hardships, as well as everyone's hardship on the Outer Banks, and it would cause irreversible damage to our environment and our community. Really what it means is identifying the issues to the site. As an Outer Banks business owner for over 25 years, a mother who raised children in these communities, an elected town of Duck official for over 12 years, and a concerned citizen, I am strongly opposed to drilling or exploration off of our coastline. We would bear the brunt of the risk and reap no financial benefit, while the lifeline of our economy would be consistently threatened. One of their posters said, trust, honesty, and respect. And I think it's time for that now. All we know is when the, they did some preliminary testing for uh, archaeological reasons down off our shores, a couple of days later, we had two dead whale shore up on the shore. So we we need to come back with trust, honesty, and respect. Lee shared the numbers earlier. We know the economic impact or the economic potential of offshore drilling does not overtake that of what we have what we see from our tourism dollars. So it poses the question, why would anyone risk a proven economic engine like tourism for offshore drilling? On behalf of the town of Pitala Hills, I express opposition to offshore drilling for oil and encourage Bowen and other stakeholders to advocate for the development of clean, renewable energy sources like offshore wind or solar. The likelihood of an oil spill is not a matter of if, but when. When one occurs, we would have nowhere to go, nowhere to enjoy ourselves, nowhere to live our lives. One spill would take all that away. Members of my generation are the future voters of this nation, and if our beaches are taken away from us, it will be the equivalent of stealing the childhood of every person who has ever grown up here or vacationed as a child. How will that make you feel if you spend your life here? Put your first steps on the dunes, learn to swim, made lifetime friends, and then all of a sudden, a group of people 300 miles away decides that you don't deserve that place and they are going to destroy it. Thank you so much. I see so many people in this room. We have town leaders, we have commissioners, I know. Warren Judge is here with us. Thank you so much, Commissioner, for being here. Um, Beverly Boswell, as well. Um, I, don't, I don't see anyone else, but, but thank you so much. Um, this, this is amazing, and it really speaks to our community. Thank you.